say good morning and welcome back to the vlog. As Liam says, we're in Cyprus. We've got got a bit of a squad for today's rollout. It's just been me, me and Liam for the last few days, but we've got a couple more. Who have we got today? We've got Annabelle. Yeah. My girlfriend and Rosie, her sister. There we go. We've rented bikes from a, from, a, from a place down the road. Yep. We're doing uh, about just under 100K. Oh, decent loop. I think it's about 2,000 meters, just over. Okay. So, shouldn't be too challenging as long as you don't run into any uh, storms. <laughs> yeah. So we have been here for a few days and yeah, I think stormy is about right. It's been very wet. It was, it was great until, it was great until you arrived. <laughs> I think you might have bought the UK weather. Gave it all I had, with everything I got. You can never take that back. I put my blood, sweat and my tears. Dedicated for years, I am my brother's keeper. I elevated my peers, made history with victory. Yes, I turn out. So we're on the big climber today, mate, right? One of them, yeah. One of them. <laughs> well, to be fair, the whole day is kind of one big climb to start, and then yeah. the whole second half is mostly downhill. But there's not many places where you can get, what's this, a 12K climb within basically 12K of our front door almost. Yeah, basically. And we've got another, another ride planned for later in the week. Where it's just 55k uphill out of the front door. Oh. So that's gonna be <laughs> another interesting one. Yeah, can't wait. <laughs> Mate, today you've matched your your socks with my with your gilet. You're and noticing that, guys. This is, uh... All right. Are we nearly there? Uh, just keep riding. We'll just you'll, keep you'll, riding. you'll find out soon. Uh, <laughs> did like 15k to go. <laughs> So those of you following me over on Instagram, or in fact TikTok, might have seen that I signed a new apparel deal. I'm now working with ASOS, so obviously they've kitted me out with all their latest and greatest kit. It was a fairly big decision for me, mostly because I've been working with Lacole, my previous sponsor, for the last seven years. So the decision didn't come lightly. Hey Liam, that's where we should go. It's going back now, almost a month ago, to the middle of December. Azos was very kind to fly me out to Switzerland to their HQ. So I made it to Barcelona airport this morning. My flight was supposed to be at 7.45. We all got on the plane ready to go and they told us the flight has been canceled. There's a problem with the aircraft. Just got on another aircraft two hours later. Same problem again. Third time lucky. for a tour of the campus which is let me tell you incredible split into different buildings for each department the main reason I'm so excited for this partnership is I'm not just an ambassador I'm actually working with ASOS directly on their content team which will enable me to use some of the social media skills that I've built up over the last few years for their channels as well as mine another thing my role at ASOS will allow me to do is work directly with some of the ambassadors that we have so hopefully all being well you can expect some content from some of those names over the coming months. Look at that. Awesome little war memorial right here by the side of the road. During my visit in Switzerland, after I met a few of my colleagues from the different departments and the CEO, who was lovely, I joined Rosalind, who works in marketing for what is normally their lunchtime spin, but for us, turned out to be a golden hour cruise. A bit chilly. <laughs> Around the beautiful lake, a loop that they normally do during their lunch hour. About an hour, normally, depending on how fast you go, of course. A really, really stunning little ride that makes the most of the incredible setting that they have there near Lake Lugano. <laughs> you can oh, do it, come on, you I can. Don't have the <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh no, okay, can't clip in. I'll, I'll Sorry. try with the left, with the right. <laughs> <laughs> wow, oh my goodness. Now we go back into Italy. Yeah. And then we go back into Switzerland. Yeah, easy, easy, maybe not. There's no flat rides here. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of Lake Lugano, the menu early the next morning was to go over to their concept store, the stunning boutique store right on the lake there for a chat about the range and getting to know some of the product lines. A really, really intense session of about two hours squeezing in as much as I possibly could into my brain 
before heading out on two wheels once again. This time with Thomas, another of my colleagues, a very handy Frenchman on the road. A different loop, still stunningly beautiful, but this time really, really cold. Two kilometers, we will stop and I will show you a beautiful spot okay. for the photos. Sounds good. Yeah. Amazing little spin up this mountain. What is it called? Uh, Sapiano. Sapiano, beautiful climb. It is snowy up here, it's icy up here. Um, we had to walk over a section because uh, we didn't want to slip off our bicycles, but we've been awarded with this amazing view of uh, Lake Lugano? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 There you go, Lake Lugano. Escape, so you can sit on that massive yeah, chair. So, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty cold, you can see this snow, but I mean, <laughs> look at that. Oh my goodness! That is amazing. All of the mountains in the background have a lot of snow on the top. I regret having my road tires up here when <laughs> Thomas has his proper gravel bike and thick tires. And just like that, in just over 24 hours, my short visit was up. Got back in the car for a lift back to the airport. All right. <laughs> Liam. There's snow on the mountains up there. I'm not sure we're going to be going that far today. No. We do want it at some point, but... It's like what? Up to Swift. I have done up to Swift a few times. Oh, good, good training then. Yeah. This is nothing compared to up to Swift. So how far have we gone off the route there? Um, I loaded the wrong route by mistake. <laughs> okay. In the frantic rush to get out of the apartment before the rain came. Yeah. Um, but I changed. I just created a new one. Okay. Whilst we we're riding, and it's going to be similar. Um, similar distance. Before they maybe come. Maybe more you downhill. Can, maybe. You can, you can tell me. Oh, it's, it's, it's all right. Then. Yeah. I'll make it sound worse though. Hundred <laughs> k to go. <clears throat> uphill. Mostly downhill. I mean, we have done thirty-six kilometers climbing so far. Would you just down here? Yeah. Check it out. Check it out. Down here? Yeah, this way to the cafe, I think. Alright. Yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, it's this way more. Like yeah, yeah, this looks right. Just as it starts to rain. Well, so it started pissing, mate. It's it's pouring. It's not pouring, but it's raining. Got in here just in time. Just in time. Got a fire. We have some cake on the way. <laughs> what are you gonna get? Uh, it all looks good. Olive pie. Olive pie. How is it? For two euros. Not bad. Absolute bargain. Time to get wet, mate. Yeah. Are you not? Are you not cold? A little bit. It's freezing. It's, it's horrible. It's disgusting. It looks yeah, it does. You're right. To be fair, on the forecast, it didn't actually say rain today, so I think we've been fairly unlucky with uh, with this. But it looks like it's just in the mountain. Correct. <laughs> I think it's going to be. Um, yeah, I mean, we can see blue skies just there. So yeah. Hopefully, right. it's okay. Yeah. Do you think we can see where we're staying? Probably oh, can use <laughs> that way somewhere. Well, it hasn't rained at all down here. The roads are bone dry. It's been too high up. <laughs> Look who just arrived. It's been so long. Four weeks. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, mate. You look like a, a basketball player from LA. <laughs> I'm not, I'm Ben and I'm in Puffles. <laughs> How much was your taxi? A lot. <laughs> How much was yours? Thirty in the end. Oh, good job. <laughs> You it bugging took, me. It took some work though. I had to <laughs> pretend to call a friend. <laughs> <laughs> Did they call you? Yeah, he was like, oh, I'll take 30. <laughs>